Hello, my beautiful crazy Verticonians. Vertico here once again for another episode of uh, Ark Survival Evolved. First and foremost, who'd have known painting blue on red makes purple? <laughs> Me, but I did not think that's how it worked in here. So underwater, it looks like a nice shade of bluey purple. Um, and above water, it looks like neon purple. So this Kyogre is going to be... A neon Kyogre. <laughs> I've got all the dyes required and we will be painting it throughout the episode. I'll do a quick time lapse at um, some point. Before I do that, guys, I have managed to go. <laughs> I've spent about two hours doing this. I've travelled with the raft on foot. I died twice. Actually, just lied. I died once. Um, going to get some crystals, coming back, so on and so forth. Then I came back and painted, painted Kyogre. I've actually wasted most of the day. I've actually supposed to be recording a vi another thing that I'm supposed to be putting up for later on that I've still not done. So, 10 out of 10 would do again. We're going to be painting this bad boy in this episode. We're also going to be raising that bad boy's level, and we're also going to be making our greenhouse over here. Um, actually, whereabouts should I make it? I think I'm making, thinking of making it about here-ish. Ah, crap, I've not made any foundations. That's something I'll do off camera in a bit, because CBA at the moment. Um, what we can do in the meantime, however, I think I might make a metal foundation. No, that's way too expensive. <laughs> Let's go ahead and make them, for God's sake. These crystals are expensive. Just Jesus, man. 307, that took me forever, because I had to wait around for them to respawn and pop the other cave as well, and it just wasn't as much in there, and I was just not happy. Oh, for God's sake, I need ceilings too. <sighs> right, okay. Um, let's get some of the stuff first, then. So we've got door frame done. What if I... Oh, I need more cementing paste. Right, okay. I, I forget. Have I got enough stuff for cementing paste? Let me have a look. Uh, keratin. I just saw some of that. I know that's usually needed. Um, oh, what am I looking at? Oh, I'm looking at the forge. That's why. <laughs> right, okay. Um... Carry in cementing paste needs stone and chitin or carrot. Right, that's not too bad then. So some more stone, more chitin. How much can I craft? Seventeen. That's still not that much. I should have some more chitin or keratin around here. Some. Whoa, <laughs> guys! If you're enjoying the series, make sure you drop a like down below. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe and join my beautiful people. All of it, it is super duper appreciated. Right, what we've got in here? Carrot or carrot? Nope. A few more tranquilizer darts, so they'll definitely come in handy. Um, a lot of spoiled meat, a few eggs in there, but no more chitin or carrot, unless I wasn't actually probably looking for them. I don't think I was, to be honest. No, nothing in there. Stone ceiling, though, so that's always good. Ah, actually saying that, there's something I did want to learn that I don't have access to at the moment. Greenhouse. Oh, God damn it. I said greenhouse. I said greenhouse! Why is it not... <laughs> Stop being fussy about a cock. Green. There we go, right. And that's the sloped roof. So I need the sloped metal house. So slope. Right, okay. So we need sloped metal roof to learn that first. And then I can learn this one. Yeah, greenhouse. That then. Right. No idea how I'm going to make this. Because the building in Ark is extremely finicky and just crap to be quite frank um it's gonna be something that's gonna bug the hell out of me but we'll give it a go uh how much more cementing paste am i gonna need because i'm gonna probably need to go and kill some things for some more of it which i'll also do off camera i sh i was actually thinking oh yeah i've got so much ready off camera i've got the painting part i've got the gallimimus part done and i didn't do this part did i so <sighs> oh wait i have got more keratin how do i skip right past that <laughs> people are probably whining at me since the beginning of the video for that as well um I need more stone though, so let's go grab some stone. I think I might some more have some more of my ankylosaur still. Let me have a look. Got any on you? No, we don't, but we've got a level boost, so we'll put weight up. A lot. <laughs> okay, we've got three levels, so the more the weight, the merrier. Um, what about you? You've also got enough level, so let's get more weight for you as well. Only one. Uh, any stone? Yeah, you've got some stone. Now, what about the next one? You got on it, stuff on you. You've got a thing on you, so oh no, you don't. You don't have that much still. Right, wait again. Still okay. Right. Um, that's some more stone for now. Let me have a look to see how much I actually collected. Probably not that much. Stop clicking on that damn thing. Right. Um, yeah, only thirty-two, but 
That gives me... Okay, right. Four. <laughs> right. We'll go get some more stone. I'm also... Well, I don't need to go get carrot or carrot, do I? I just need to get more stone. What else do I need to do? Um... Ah, platform. So I'm going to need to get some stone anyway because I want to build at least wood or stone. I think wood would look quite nice in a... No, it wouldn't. Stone wood. Stone would look good and quite nice in a thing. So we're going to go ahead and grab some more stone, guys. And we will I'll probably jump on the <laughs> Enkylosaur for that. But why the hell have I put it on this one? I don't know. Oh, it's because it's level 108. So let's take him off anyway. What's his melee like? Melee's 216 and weight is 347. And his guy's... Uh... 280 and 135. Oh, good God, no. Yeah, we'll keep it on this guy. Okay, it's turning nighttime, so we'll be right back once I've got plenty of stone and required items. BRB. And we are back, and I have got a few things done. I've built this little taddy bridge. <laughs> we'll work on it in the future, don't worry about it. That has to go through the side at least twice, just so it doesn't have to go underwater. But it's all good. It basically means I don't have to run all the way around. And it does save a bit of time. Um, you guys might be wondering, why, why am I coming over here? Well, I was going to do it over there. But the land really isn't flat enough for my liking. Um, so what I did is, just so you guys think, oh, but how did he get those foundations that far under? Well, there's a simple little trick to doodles you can do. What you do is you uh, line up the foundation right here. Then just build it inland until it becomes the perfect level that you want it. Right, I have built loads. I am probably going to say I've wasted so many hours in this game at this point. I may as well keep doing it. Right, okay. I pretty much know my plan and how I want to set it up. Uh, so I'm going to do it from here. Obviously. I'm going to get my door down. Look at that. This is like almost perfect, obviously if it looked a bit more reinforced for the underwater bases, guys, just saying, hurry up and get those out. Because that's pretty much where I will reside for most of my life in this game. Um, right. Because imagine just like seeing a massive giant squid just swim by, it's like, oh, cool man. Right, okay. Thinking I might have made a mistake with the parameter of this build. I think I might need some more walls. I think I might be alright though. Let's have a look. Oh, oh, I think we're just okay. Um, right. Oh, crud. Um, right, so. <laughs> that's that part done. Here is the fun part. So, the ceiling. I've not got enough, I don't think. I don't know. Let's have a look. So, eight is replaced. Um, Don't know why it's automatically... No, no. I thought... Oh, you can rotate it, but it's... <sighs> so, I don't know why it's doing it like that. So if I put a wall up here, say, maybe. Let's try it. I'm slightly confused, guys. I will give you that much. <laughs> I have no idea how these things work. Um, I don't. I don't know why it's, like, snapping to that. So, why? Why is it snapping? I was wanting my sort of wall um, ceilings to go like that, okay? And then like that on the other side. Oh, stop picking up freaking things! Let me just attach something. There we go. I don't get why it's got a... Why has it got a... I don't get it. Hold up. Let me try a different thing. I've got to try maybe with the ceiling first and said that I haven't got enough walls. I am aware of that now, guys. I'm happy to go build some more, but I want to get this sorted first and my design sorted. Right. Okay, I'm going to get inside for this because it's going to keep bugging me, isn't it? Okay, let's quickly get rid of the wall so it doesn't do anything. I want to see the animation for the door opening as well. Okay, that's still not what I want. So, it let me in. There we go. Right, so five. Perfect. Now, are you going to do what I want you to do? Oh, I saw it. No. You are not. Right, okay, try E. That that looks okay, <laughs> admittedly. There. Uh, I'm going to have to do it like that, aren't I? Right, can you not go here? Um, can you not? No, okay. Um, let me try like this. How about now? Can you go like... No? How come it can go everywhere but where I need it to go? Like, look. It won't rotate there though, so... Let's try... No, okay. 
Why won't you be nice to me? Oh, right. Okay, let's just get these ones across first then. There we go. Right, so we've got that part completely covered. That I'm happy with. But why? Oh, why won't it work? Let me try something else. So if I was to maybe put this here. Uh, but then I wouldn't need the, the slant, essentially, would I? Okay, let me try like this. Let me try like this. Maybe. Just maybe. Yes! Right, okay. There we go. Problem solved. I will then get rid of this. I'm going to need a slope wall. Right, okay. So problem is solved. Only problem is... I, well, I, I should be able to join it up afterwards, so... No. Okay. <laughs> I think it's just a matter of orientation. Um, <laughs> this is probably the best sort of video you'll ever be able to watch, guys, because of this. It's me getting absolutely... You're so glad you shouldn't... You should be... You should be very glad you can't hear me rage at the moment. Um, Inside. Internally, I'm saying a few naughty words, to say the very least. Right, okay. Okay, right. Okay, let's live without for now. Come on. And one more. Just for good measure, guys. Come on. No. Oh, oh, we had it. Oh, we had it. Bingo. Right. This is how I wanted it. This is how it's going to turn out. Let's get rid of this wall. I will build a slope wall to go between this. So don't worry, guys. Um, that's a roof. That's not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for the wall. I'm looking for this wall. Okay, so it's that one. So it is that one. Perfect. Right. We'll fit the um, slant one there. But now, <laughs> now we've got to try and get this to work. So I'm thinking what might have happened is because that's not the same direction. or well, It was the same orientation. It was, yeah, of course it would be. Because, I mean, it can't be, I guess, because it's not, I don't know. Right, okay. Um. You can rotate, though. I know you can. <laughs> you bugger. I don't want to have to, but I think I'm going to have to break this glass here and rotate that. But I'm going to have to get another one anyway, so... It's fine. What I'll do is I'll do another jump. <laughs> another one. <laughs> right, just because I'm, I'm going to have to rage. I have to audibly rage in a minute and say a few C words. So we'll be back in a minute. And once that's done, hopefully we'll have this sorted. BRB! <laughs> We're back for the last time in this episode. Right, so we've got it finished. Um, there's a few places where it's a bit disjointed, but all in all, I think it looks perfectly, perfectly perfect. I love the stone on the bottom. I really do. I must say this turned out perfectly. What has also reminded me is I now know how to use, or remind me, it's taught me, is I now know how to use these slopes and you need the... Um, Watch my flips. You need these guys as well. They're pretty important for it. So we'll make sure we've got them in the future. Guys, what my next plan is, is or well, next build, I guess. I'm hoping to, um, I've got a bridge sorted out that we're going to work on at some point. Um, I want to work on a pen or a paddock over there in that massive in crevice. Just making sure we're not preventing any metal spoiling. So I'm trying to be careful with where I build things. But right here, we've got like a little um, sort of perfect area for a gate. Um, we'll wall it off here, preventing anything from getting in. Wall off there. Then we've got a perfect little gateway area right just before the um, pier. So just bring it over to here-ish. Uh, be perfect and make sure we don't let anything in or out that we don't want to, of course. And then right up here, or maybe on the left-hand side of the gate, of, of right over there, I'm going to build a lighthouse, which we call, can, of course, use glass for as we have these bad boys now. So it's perfect. Right. We are going to put the plants and whatnot in here. We'll be working on that soon. I'll also need to get some pipage and in whatnot into here, which I'm sure we can put through the glass or something. I don't know. We'll work it out when it comes to it. <laughs> so that is all good. As for the next part of this, I'm going to go dump this lot away, and we're going to continue painting Kyogre. So it's going to look a bit like the Pokemon, I'm hoping. Um... Trying to orientate a giant Mosasaurus, which basically takes up the whole screen. <laughs> However, it's a wee bit difficult, as you might understand. So, we'll give it a go. Um, I'm going to go ahead and drop this all off in here. Grab the red and white. We've pretty much finished with the blue, but we'll bring it just in case I screw up. Which there is a high chance I don't need this lot either. 
So get rid of, get rid, get rid, just in case I need these in the future, which I'm sure I will, because I love the way it looks. It's like one of my favorite building materials. So white, blue, red. And where's the paintbrush? Already in my inventory. So we'll stick it in number seven. Right, okay. Let's go ahead and approach the Kyogre. I'm going to get on top of him so I don't drown while I'm painting him. And then there's only certain parts where you can hit him to paint. I know it's a bit patchy in some places. There we go. Right, okay. So I'm going to uh, go ahead and do this, guys. You're going to have uh, music and stuff and a speeded up time lapse while I look at images and try and marry it up as much as possible to Kyogre. So, BRB! Yeah, we're about a couple of minutes into it, and I think it's official already. I suck. <laughs> I think I need black to really outline it, but we'll we'll, we'll keep it going. We'll we'll, we'll keep it going. <laughs> And that is that, guys. Right, let's. Uh, it didn't look too bad towards the end. The red really suited it. Um, I just don't like the fact it's purple. But I think overall, I have seen what. I've not seen much worse, but I have seen worse. 
<laughs> I'd like it if you had like a circle tool and all the different tools with shapes and stuff. It'd be a lot easier to do this. But for what it is, I'm not too fussed. And I think it could have it could have gone worse. It could have gone worse, guys. <laughs> Anyway guys, that's where we're going to end the video today. If you've enjoyed the video, make sure to drop a like down below. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe and join me, you beautiful, beautiful, beautiful people. And um, if you didn't enjoy the video, feel free to dislike, but do tell me why. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day and ta-ra!